So nowadays, I mean, you've got a lot going on. Obviously, you just outlined uh, with your with your methodology and things you're doing uh, with uh, institutions of higher education. But you've got other companies as well. You've got Klitschko Ventures. You've got K2 Promotions. You have your own foundation. On any given day, how are you spending your time now post-boxing? I'm blessed. That's how I feel it. Lucky. Really lucky to have allies that I have in my life. I cannot function without allies. I don't want to be a box promoter only. It's too boring for me. Only. I want to have better orientation and I can have it if I'm exposed to different views and challenges. And my understanding of the world, because we all kind of, they're crossing of our paths. So it is important for the orientation and um, identify next challenges that you want to take, the more knowledge you have. I don't want to say I like, uh, I do everything. No, I don't. I have my own philosophy, what I don't do and what I do. And uh, I have decided, as I said, not to be attached to one industry. I have different interests, and that's what actually makes me happy. That uh, on one hand, even though I'm a boxing promoter with K2, but I'm not a boxing promoter because I have an ally, the CEO of the company, promotional company, K2. Uh, if it's a family office, then I have professionals that are good at finances and, and they've been spending their lifetime and still doing it. And so I'm getting, I'm getting from them the knowledge um, about my own finances and also finance of the others. So how can I do it as good as the others or even better? Now build, build tells. And I'm atelier, but not really, because I have a team that is with allies that are doing it. And I'm happy to give up um, the responsibility with consequences. Speaking of trust, so I trust you, you're going to do it. And I failed a couple of times, and it's okay. But it's not going to stop me to trust another person again. Because eventually I'm going to get what I want and in, in this process. You, you make mistakes, you fail. Uh, but after every failure, you like I'm getting like in the boxing ring, we talk about it. Now I know how, how it's going to work. As soon as I failed, <laughs> all of a sudden, you're just realizing now I know that I'm going to be successful because now I know the crucial mistake that I possibly will not do, <laughs> not possibly, will not do it again because I failed. And um, the variety of activities, political ventures, um, companies, and especially professionals, experts, and not to forget, there are not too many experts. And my formula is nine to 10, I mean, nine to 10 in percentage. So real experts are 10% or less. And trust me, they are also in boxing. And I know, as a matter of fact, my, my men in boxing and women. You have out of 10, nine fighters and one warrior. That warrior is an expert. <laughs> the rest are fighters. I mean, they would love to win, but it doesn't work. Okay, maybe next time. And the warrior never stops. He's eventually gonna get what he wants because he's a true warrior. And, um, and it applies, unfortunately, medical industry, doctors, only minor percentage are experts and the rest are doctors. Lawyers, 
if you think about it, it's pretty much in every industry, you've got this big amount of professionals and small amount of experts. And that's just, it's my formula of 90, 10, more or less. And, um, and I was asking myself, Vlad, are you a charlatan or an expert? Because you're doing like so much, you can't be good at it. And I was a charlatan at some period of time and I didn't like it. So my answer is I'm not because I have allies. I have the team of experts. I cannot have knowledge in all of this, but I can put a team together or capable of, and I know how to shape it. And I love doing it. None of us is stronger than all of us. And that's how I take it. So I'm alone, not strong enough. But if I'm going with everyone else, then we're a strong force. <laughs>